So guys, for the first step, you want to head over to search and type in troubleshoot settings. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on other troubleshooters. And then next to Windows Update, you want to click on Run. And you want to run the Windows Update Troubleshooter. If there's any problems, then it will fix it for you. Now for the second step, you want to head over to search and type in File Explorer. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to click on this PC. And then you want to find a drive where you have Windows installed on. It's probably going to be your C drive. And then click on Windows. And then scroll down until you find Software Distribution. Here it is. You want to double click on it. You want to delete everything in this folder. Click on Do This For All Current Items. And then click on Continue. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in services. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to look for background intelligent transfer service. Here it is right here. You want to double click on it. Change the startup type to automatic and then click on start. And click on OK. Now we're going to scroll down again till we see cryptographic services. Here it is right here. You want to double click on it. Make sure that the startup type is on automatic and that you click on start. And now you want to click on any service again and click on W on your keyboard. You want to scroll down until you find Windows Update. Here it is right here. You want to double click on it. Make sure that the startup type is on automatic and that the service is running. So click on start and then click on OK. Now you want to reset your computer and then the problem should be fixed. 